completely random, but it is still something that uh, it just makes this it makes this a very interesting pick to me as the uh, the map for MIR to go into here. I wonder what exactly it is like. Uh, in your experience, what do you think would be their reasoning for picking this particular map? The gateway map? is not very effective on this map. Uh, you know, Channel, we're going to see him jump down. He's going to just try to place a gateway right to the left, basically. Uh, that's the only one you can get, and you really can't get a full-length gateway, uh, which is one of the most important escape mechanisms that this team has. You know, when, when Soda CC'd, uh, Talvador wants to jump through that gateway, get behind a pillar on the other side of the map, and start healing himself up. That's what lets him sit through that CC, but on this map, he's not going to be able to do that. Here we go. Channel's going to be jumping out, looking for that exact gateway that I was talking about here. Um, but it's really not that long of a, of a distance there. So, you know, that that is really why they're doing this. Um, also, it's very hard to finish off uh, the Shattered Play teams, Zunyaki, Mimpoike, and Nole for on this map because they can kind of turtle behind the boxes. If you push in, uh, you can get you can get feared into a bad spot and swap to. So it uh, can be pretty scary. Yeah, one of the, the upsides, though, for, uh, for Skillcap's team here is that with that symbiosis, they will have a... Uh, I, why can I not think of that thing right there? I cannot think of the name. Can you help me out here? I forgot the name of the ability. Uh, which the, ability? Sorry. Um, I'm sorry. The the druid thing that makes the silence. I cannot remember the name of it for the life of me right now. I'm really bad at this. Oh, I'm sorry. Well. Anyway, anyway, yeah, Zunyaki is going to be the target here uh, for the LSD, it looks like. Uh, he's going to be taking quite a bit of damage, fully dotted up there by Channel. Channel uh, pushing in here, uh, looking to get something done, uh, you know, trying to trying to start something up for his team. Uh, we're going to see Mimpoike here once again, just back behind that pillar. You can see Talbadar pushing in now, uh, looking to get a little bit aggressive on him. There's a Hal Terror. Shadow Fury going to come down. No Lifer has to trick it. Zunyaki dispels MD, and um, he's, he's going to be taking a lot of damage here. Uh, he's down really, really low, 30k. Uh, is wow. he going to be able to survive here? And he's just going to go down without dispersing. Two games in a row. Wow. The cooldown's used just way too late. Yeah, this time choosing to focus on Zuniaki instead of No Lifer. I don't know if they were really expecting that this time around. It was very, very interesting that uh, just to see him again with that burst damage going down so quickly. And like you said, he did not manage to get that dispersion off in time. So he was not able to survive through that whole thing. These really, really quick matches and really quick kills coming out of skill capped here. Yep, so uh, a very, very exciting match there. They are going to be up 2-0 uh, now.